Our blood is made up of four components, plasma, which is the water fluid part of our blood, platelets, which are important for blood clotting so we don't overbleed, red blood cells called erythrocytes, which have hemoglobin that carries oxygen throughout our body, and white blood cells called leukocytes, which are basically our immune system. White blood cells or leukocytes can be split into two groups, granulocytes, which look grainy under a microscope, and agranulocytes, which don't look grainy under a microscope. For granulocytes, there's neutrophils, which do phagocytosis and eat up foreigners at the beginning of an infection. There's basophils and mast cells, which release histamine, which is important for inflammation and allergies. And there's eosinophils, which fight off parasitic infections like worm infections, and they're important in allergies. For agranulocytes, there's monocytes, of which there's macrophages and dendritic cells, which do phagocytosis, and they're also antigen-presenting cells. And for lymphocytes, there's natural killer cells, which kill viral infected cells and cancer cells, B cells, which make antibodies, and T cells, which are an important part of adaptive immunity.